What's going on, guys? Welcome back to Tales from the Borderlands. It's been a whole while, and now that I've finished Game of Thrones, I can finally get back to this and finish this up because I'm pretty sure I have one episode left. I'm, yeah. See, last time we did Escape Plan Bravo, where, well, we know what happened to Scooter, unfortunately. And now we have the Vault of the Traveler and. I think hopefully they're going to tell us what happened last time because there is some fogginess to my memory when it comes to what happened last time. So let's just jump right in and see if they give us any information of like what happened so I can just get caught up. I remember some things, but some other things, they're, they're, they're a little hard to remember. <laughs> hopefully they tell us. Here we are at the finale. Yes, yes. Of what course, Marcus will I tell us. Finally, huh? <laughs> yeah, whatever. I don't write this stuff. If you recall, the long journey to the Vault of the Traveler actually began by accident. Atlas's gorgeous robot was designed to not only summon the Vault of the Traveler, it was also meant to deal with the complications of entering the Vault. Mm. Yep. Two unlikely vault hunters began to assemble it, but one component remained out of reach on a Hyperion space station. Pressed into service by the local crime lord, they concocted a plan to sneak aboard. The corporate lackey had access to inside information, but he didn't dare reveal his source. An old rival provided a priceless disguise, <laughs> while new allies helped cobble together a rummage sale yeah, rocket you ship. Have to sell for rocket. Once again, tempting fate, they flung themselves into space. Indeed, they would have died up there were it not for the sacrifice of a noble soul. Oh. Finally, aboard the space station. The salaryman found himself contending with his ambitious former accomplice. But time was short, and he was very busy, so he referred her to his assistant. Working together, the gun artist and the salaryman managed one last miracle and acquired the final Cortis component. At that moment, the former middle manager discovered that the plan had worked. Not there. <laughs> and some jabs. Yeah, I remember that bit. I remember that bit. So that's pretty much where we left off, I guess. Cool. Which again, I pretty much remember all of this. I thought she was. No, I knocked her out, but she wasn't dead. Okay. One of the cells for questioning. Oh, I'll get out of this. Living a life of crime. <laughs> Forgot about him. What you in for? They got me at one of the security checkpoints. Oh, yeah. What does that say? Limnos. We're here to be shot, Cody. Oh yeah. <laughs> what? We all know about the plan. We intercepted your comms. So. Oh, cool! So we don't have to explain. Would have been cool. That asshole electrocuted me and ran. So as you can imagine, I'm really looking forward to finding him. Listen, if I were you, I'd just take my little crew, walk on out of here, and pretend I didn't see any of this. Well, luckily, I warned her. Not me. I warned her. Remember that. I warned her. What the hell is that? I like how we're not noticing the uh, blood on the ground. All right, well, punch. Aw, oh, I was too slow. I was way too slow. Punch. Ah. Oh. Her face will remember that. Get them into the cell. I was a little too slow. That kind of sucks. I heard what sounded like a dying animal. Yeah, that sound. Reese. What is going on up there? Can I get up there? We should be able to. I'm pretty sure we can get up there. 
with the ladder being r right there. Doesn't look like he's having a good time. Know what I mean? Oh, this just feels right. You know, like it was meant to be. Vault hunters kill me. I learn humility. You bring me back where I belong, wiser and stronger. It's a, it's a pretty sweet little character arc, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Except for that part where I learned humility. That's that's crap. Because <laughs> whatever, I got people for that. Let me go, you asshole. Ah, oh, come on, Reesey, don't be like that. I mean, are you gonna die? Yeah, technically you are. But look at the bright side. I'm still gonna use your body to eat food and bang people and whatnot. Damn. Like it's gonna go to waste. It is gonna go to waste. It's not me. Oh, so that prototype I was talking about? Oh, what are you gonna do with that hand? Oh, hold on. So if you could just stay still, this is gonna get grafted into your body, and then I'll get up and put it into you. Wait, what? Don't worry though, sweetheart. The process will kill the shit out of you. So you oh. won't have to suffer as a mind-controlled zombie slave or whatever. So you got that going for you. Couldn't figure out how to get this thing into my body without killing me, but hey, <laughs> doesn't matter if you die. You can't do this. Kinda does matter. I, say that. I clearly can and I clearly will. No, seriously, I mean you can't. You're stuck in my head, Jack. Our minds are connected. If I die, you die, remember? Oh, is that how you thought you were going to get out of it? Hopefully. Sorry. That's not how it works anymore. Great. I've transferred my Great. To the computer systems of the base. You know what that means? We're not connected. <sighs> Can't you use someone else's body then? Oh no. That's too big of a chainsaw to work. Someone coming to the rescue? Someone's gotta come to the rescue. What? Why? Why is that necessary? Oh, it's a rolling chair. Well, he, he messed up. Can I roll? Roll away. Time to just roll the hell away. Can I not keep rolling? I should still roll. <laughs> yep. Yep. What am I trying to do here? Okay. I should still be able to oh. Can I grab that? I have a free hand. Yeah. Oh, I need that. Oh. Okay, grab that and run. Grab it and run. Run, run. Ow. What is your freaking problem, Reese? Uh, I'm trying not to die. Get back here. All right, well, you can stay in Helios for the rest of your life. I don't really care. I'm just trying to get the hell out of here. That's one way to get down. You all right? I heard screaming. Very shrill screaming. I don't know if I've told her the truth or not yet, but might as well start. Okay. I don't really know what that means. Well, nothing good. Hey, we need to go. Oh yeah. I'm sorry my internal bleeding is <laughs> us up. Where's uh What was her name? Yvette? Okay. Remember how her face was gonna remember the floor? You're not doing shit. Oh that? there she is. Well, hello, 
that. I can't believe you shocked me, asshole. You betrayed me. All we've been through, little prick. Yeah, you betrayed me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You <laughs> betrayed me. Remember? I never had you electrocuted. Wow. So, uh, would have ended up dying. Really so. Specific act. What? What about you trying to kill me? Yeah. You're never gonna make it. Get used to that idea. Cool, cool. I'll just put that in my back pocket. It was <laughs> really fun <laughs> catching up with that. Have a great life being an awful person. Okay, bye. Yep. Warning lockdown protocol in effect. Hey, we gotta go. Gotta yeah, go. I'm just taking my time here. I'm just go. strolling, looking at everyone in the who's locked up. Reese, we got a problem. <laughs> Add it to the list. The hangar bay doors just locked tighter than a bully monk's jaw. The caravan ain't going nowhere. Sasha! Heads up! Oh, why was that such a weak toss? Oh, he broke it. Oh no. Shit. Oh. Reese, Good toss. Take the beacon and get the caravan ready. I'll get the hangar doors open. I can override it in the power yeah. core. Yeah, okay, do that. But you know, be careful. There are guards all over the place. Uh, it's true. Danger seems to follow us. Yeah, kind Watch of. Out for August, okay? I don't trust that guy as far as I can throw him. Yeah, you don't strike me as having a lot of upper body strength. Oh, oh, okay. You know what? <laughs> Watch out for August. Got it. Can you get that out? Yeah, he can. Okay. Come on, hang your base this way. They should really put that out, uh, put it away instead of just like, you know, having it out in the open where everyone's gonna see on, that you have it. I think they did put it away. Cool. Daddy's home. Cool, they did. What's going on? Yes, dare to dream. It's me, handsome Jack, your favorite. I'm back, <laughs> digital flesh baby, and I need you. Uh oh. To help me find my very good friend. Whatever it is, it can't be good. Once upon a time, there was a lowly Hyperion stooge named Reese. What's his name? He was just like all of Gortz? you. Gortz? Except he really, really sucked. Now Reese. Is that Gentle, gentle Jim? Gentle Jim. No. Handsome Jack. Oh, what did I say? If you knew my plan, you'd, you'd think that was really, really clever. Okay, don't worry about it. So, as a reward, whoever finds my old soon to be eviscerated pal Reese will receive all company bonuses, Ooh. A planet facing office, and keys to the executive washroom. It's actually a pretty good deal. Has something called a toil urinal that is just we need to get to the hangar bay now. It's dope. It sounds dope. Hey, hey, you idiot. You look like the kind of moron that hangs out with metal management. Do you know where Reese is? I, uh. Is he the one with the glasses? Oh. Uh, yes, let's... oh. Yeah, that looks like something that Jack would do. You know, even though it's full of flesh-eating monsters, Pandora suddenly feels a lot safer than here. Someday, I want to live on a nice land. Good luck with that. Good luck with that. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, ladies. Good. Well. Right. Where the hell is Reese? I got every On Pandora? Helios employee looking for that ass clown. So save him some major cat strain and turn him in already. Dunno. I haven't seen him. Yeah, right, sure. Nice try, babe, but you oh. know where he is. Your friends always think it's cool to stand up for other friends, but it's a sucker play. Always rat. Ratting is awesome. You could be <laughs> Let's go, Fiona. He can't touch us. His argument. Well, you are just 100% <laughs> right about that, pumpkin. I can't, but my guards and their bullets sure can, and a shit ton of them are heading to you right now. Could get messy. So in the essence of saving on cleanup costs, why don't we just figure this out together, huh? I mean, I'll be straight with you. Reese is definitely gonna die, but you don't have to. I mean, I don't care enough about you to kill you. No way in hell I'm trusting the douchebag who tried to destroy my planet. Oh. Ooh, uh, good point. Really? Douchebag? <laughs> Such a hateful word. That's why I used it. Douchebag. Mm. Good points. Uh, Just making a lot of good points. Guards. Now remember, you had a uh -oh. chance to avoid this next part. You think on that. 
while you're headbutting bullets.